welcome back to my channel. I know I'm in a different setting right now. The lighting has been so crazy because it's so bright in my apartment that I use like a ring light as well. And the light comes from my window from one side. So basically it lights like up one side of my face and it's like overexposed and the other side of my face is like a shadow. And so I had to find a different place to film. So I'm filming in a different area of my apartment if you're wondering. And I'm still using a ring light. So let me know how you like this area. This area is easier for me to film in. It's just like a little when you walk into my living room because it, it doesn't depend on the lighting because like I said the windows to the left of me if you've watched the videos of where I film on my couch always kind of weirdly disproportionate my face even if I put the blinds down it's still like the brightness kind of contrasts with the shadow and so I feel like I need to find a place that's a little more like shaded and then I can use a ring light to you know light it up light it up um but today I'm going to be doing a haul I'm so excited. I'm doing a haul from Misguided. You guys know I love Misguided. I think it's one of the most iconic websites. I wish this was sponsored on um, Misguided, feel free, but I like them. They have fast shipping. It's like two days, the express delivery. I think it's DHL. Um, all their stuff is super cute. They ha have a student discount. They always have amazing sales. So they're honestly great, like cute stuff, great prices, fast shipping. I mean, I don't know what else you could ask for. So I have a random, not a random, but a thing that I got not from Misguided, so I'll show at the end as well. But what I got is this jacket, and I love this jacket so much. It is just like a jean jacket, but it's kind of one of those, like the new kind of trendy ones. My mom, the other day she visited me, and she was wearing like, this trendy jacket from Zara, and I was like, well, you were literally ahead of it. And then I got inspired by it and I saw somewhere on Misguided. So it has like the kind of bell bottom looking sleeves as you can tell, like these big kind of open ones. They're so fun. And then just a normal collar and the kind of like the frills. I think that the frills are super fun in the back and they're on the front of the jacket, like where the pocket is like a little, a little frilly frill and a little frilly frill. And it's just really cute for fall. It's something different. I love basic oversized jean jackets. If you've watched my last three hauls, I've gotten like two or three new like oversized fun jean jackets for the fall which I'm so excited about but I also thought it would be nice to have like more of a trendy one and I feel like this one would be like a little bit more dressed up if I were to dinner versus like an oversized and this one's like a little bit more put together and I love it so so much it's so cute and I got this I'll go over size if people really ask me this is a US size 2 and it fits really nicely then Miss Guy had a collab with Barbie um, like the brand it was misguided times Barbie. It was so cute. I literally wanted everything in the collection. There's some of cute t-shirts that said like Barbie and cute designs and cute like patent like skirts and it was so cute. Um, but I figured I'd go with something that I'd wear the most. So I picked up these joggers. They're white and they're high waisted and then the, it's so cute. Barbie times misguided hashtag official baby uniform. So cute. These joggers are in a US size 2 and the tag is so cute. It's like Barbie type of misguided. I just think white and baby pink look so pretty together. Like it just really sold me. They have nice little pockets and then black cursive. It just says Barbie on it, which I think is super cute. Like I said, they're white. Perfect for lounging around. Like I feel like I could definitely see these when I'm editing or, you know, working on guides and things like that. I said you work from home a lot. It's perfect for me to wear these to lounge around. And they're just like so, I think white sweatpants are just so pretty. I don't know, I just really like them. <laughs> and I think that they'll be nice to wear out as well. I do wear sweatpants out if I'm running errands. So this with like a black t-shirt, really cute, comfy, and they're really still flattering on. Like they have a nice high waist and they make your butt look nice and they are cuffed at the ends. This is like out of my comfort zone, this sweater. I feel like it's my style, but out of my comfort zone. When I saw it, I was like, I have to have it. I love that. It's nothing like that I've ever worn before. I FaceTimed my mom and showed it to her. I FaceTimed my friend and showed it to her. And they're all like, kind of like, I love it. Like, but is that your style? And I was like, girl, it's gonna be. So I picked up this multicolor, like, rainbow, chunky sweater. So it's like baby pink. It's all like pastel, which I love. If this is normal colors. I don't know if I'd like it as much. I love that it. it's pastels. It's like a pastel pink, a lilac, a baby blue, and a yellow. And just like a chunky, fun knit. And it's so pretty. Like, I literally am never in color. Like, I'm always in, like, neutrals, black, white, or neutrals, or nude even tones. So this is definitely outside of my comfort zone to wear, but I think it's so beautiful and so, like, I don't know, just fun. <laughs> I'd probably wear it something dressed out. I'd probably make it, like, a little sported, wear little lemons, and maybe some sort of, like, Adidas or something like that shoe. Just, like, I don't know. I couldn't know how else. I don't, I don't know if I'd wear it with jeans, even. I probably would wear it to like oversized with leggings somehow. I don't know what shoe would look good. Maybe like a Gucci slip on. I still need to break those in. If you guys have any advice on how to break in shoes, let me know. I have these pair of Gucci slip ons. They're like, not even, they're like, they look like Vans, but just Gucci. And they're really, really painful. I've tried wearing them like 20 times to break them in, and they give me the worst blisters. And. <sighs> 
very hard, but um, so I've been trying to break those in because they would be a really great go-to shoe for me to wear. So if you have any life hacks, let me know. But I probably wear leggings, those. And this is just so cute, so I love that. I got this romper, which I think would like, I don't even want to think about it. Like, okay, what are your thoughts on the holidays? Like, I like the holidays, but I'm not like obsessed. Like, people are like, oh my gosh, like, I can't wait for Christmas. Like, oh my gosh, I can't wait for this, blah, blah, blah. I think there's maybe two reasons why I'm not like psychotically excited. Maybe one, I live in LA, so it doesn't like snow or anything like that like I used to when I lived in Chicago. Two, like I don't want really to put up a Christmas tree in my apartment because one, I don't want to lug up a Christmas tree. Like, I have to like mount it to my car, bring it to my apartment, like, br in the elevator, hold my tree, bring it down, put a tree, I don't know, will Coco eat, Coco will try to climb the tree, the tree's gonna shut, like, the tree is a lot, you know, so I, like, don't, I don't know, I feel like I don't get the full vibe, also, it's not that cold, so, but I am going on a fun trip somewhere in the next month and a half-ish, and I'm so excited, we'll be vlogging, um, where it's cold, and I can wear, like, all my jackets and things like that, and I'm so excited, and do like a few like holiday things but anyway this reminds me of something i'd wear to like a holiday dinner or something uh it's just like a black romper but it's so unique and looks really expensive that's what i love it's black like chiffon has these things have been super popular and then like little flowers and they have such detail like, there are four lit wait four i don't say four i would say two or three layers of like the material for each flower and they're like all over it like they're everywhere and oh, just, this guy is just so great they always have like literally 30% off, 40% off, 50% off, or even the student discount, and the price is already great, and all the stuff is just so well made, so I'm just like really shocked at, I'm impressed, I wouldn't say shocked, um, and then it's off the shoulder, and literally those flowers go throughout the whole thing, and then the bottom is like frilly, like the, the bottom of the romper is really frilly and cute, and then it has like a little chiffon tie, and it just like ties in the center, it looks really flattering on, I feel like this with a little, little airbrush tan, a little, a little self tan, and then some like red shoes around the holiday season would be so beautiful, so I picked this up also in a US too. This skirt I picked up and I love, and I mainly got this, I'm not even gonna lie, I got this skirt to wear probably for like a shoot or something, I don't know where, I, how, what, where or how long I can wear this in public for, it's like a latex black skirt, um, I just think it's gonna be really cool for photos, it's a fun piece. Um, this is what it looks like. It literally looks like latex when I'm showing it to you, but it's a mini skirt for sure. It's super tight. Again, US size 2. They have really they have good sizing. They have a wide, wide variety of sizes, and they have, a, they have a, still a zero, so if you're smaller, and they go up. I think they even have a plus line, so. Um, but super cute. I mean, I'm sure, if I was going to wear this, I'd have to, like, dress the rest. Either I'd go, like, psycho, like, I would wear, like, a bralette and make it, like, super scandalous, and I'd probably, like, it'd probably be for, like, photos or something you know i'm not going to go to whole foods in this and then or if i was going to try to wear it i probably want to dress it down I'd probably wear like some type of cropped sweater i don't even know it's it's the latex is pretty wild but it, just for like a night to dinner or a night out or something like that this could be really fun it was just a piece i was like i need to have this in my closet like if i ever need a statement i can use this really easily i got this which i love it's like a bodysuit and it has like the snakes i think they're definitely inspired by the whole gucci snake trend um it's basically like a white polka dot mesh what size did i get this in extra small this is extra small yeah. yeah so it's super cute and then long sleeve and the sleeves are again those like popular sleeves but you can tell me what these are called if you want um and then the embroidery on the boob i mean if you want to be scandalous i probably wouldn't wear a bra but it was the night time but if you want to be you know a little more kosher a nice little tank top a nice little black bralette you know i don't think probably a white bralette would be more fun and then you know it hooks like a bodysuit in the bottom i think that this would like some like ripped jeans like distressed boyfriend jeans would be really cute and i like that i got two pairs of shoes that i'm literally obsessed with and like normally i don't know like there's shoes i get and i'm like oh i love it they'll be great for a photo or there's shoes i get I'm like oh these are great to wear like all the time it's hard to find a shoe that i'm like this is a great all the time shoe and it's like so iconic like, do you know what i mean like either you find a shoe you're like this is so fun like when i'm gonna go do something or i'm gonna wear this shoe or you find shoes you're like these are great everyday shoes it's hard. i'm not that saying these are everyday shoes but these are definitely shoes that i'm gonna wear a lot throughout the next few months the first are these booties I got. I think that these are definitely inspired by the whole Kim K booty trend. They're just black and they're just kind of, I don't know, what length is this? Like, I'm just, I'll show you. You get it. Um, and then they just lace up. I feel like these are going to be really great. I love, I need to try a Zara package now I think about it. Because I ordered just black high-waisted denim jeans. So I figure like these with black high-waisted denim jeans and then a chunky sweater. I have a ton of them. Just intermixing them is a perfect nightfall look. Like if I, if I don't want to think about a fall look and I want to look 
like comfy but cute but still like damn you know like she tried because the shoes when you put when you wear it when you step in out in these people think you tried they're like damn girl like the laces like they look intense for sure but like you know what i mean just a black jean these and then a chunky sweater it literally looks like she's so put together but all you did was basically like put on these you know what i mean so i need to track where those pants are but and then or these with rompers the only thing is i wonder if they have these in nude because i will order them if they have them in nude because black does cut off your legs so much i'm shorter i'm five feet two inches if you've met me a girl either it's like the first thing people say to me they're like you're so small i'm like no <laughs> but so if i wear these with like a skirt something like that i would still do it but it will cut off my leg because i'm shorter but if they were nude it would elongate your leg but i can definitely see myself even wearing it with like that black romper or I love rompers, you guys know I have so many rompers, like a romper, a suede jacket, and this, just great look, or a romper, a jean jacket, and this. Jean jackets, these boots, and rompers this fall are amazing. And last page, I already showed a little bit of a sneak peek of these in the vlog. If you watch my vlogs, I post pretty consistently if you want to check that out. But I showed these shoes. I love these. I wanted a red pair of shoes that are going to be like my holiday shoe. Thanksgiving, I'm there. Christmas, I'm there. Pre-ice skating dinner, I'm there. Dinner at your aunt's house, I'm there. Dinner at your dog's house, I'm there. Red shoe, and they have like the little thin strap, which is super popular, and then they even have a strap around your ankle, which I love ankle straps, and then it has this fun little red fluff with like silver metallic detailing around it. So pretty, so fun. I mean, I'm not even, you could literally wear this with anything, and they're red, so they're such a fun accent piece. I promise you, like if I was wearing that black off the shoulder romper, and then these for like some type of holiday thing, so 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 cute and i don't think it's limited to holidays i mean red's cool year round you know but especially if it's you know fall red like mm, can't wait to wear these um can't wait to wear these to the pumpkin patch but they're so cute so i was so excited to get these and i definitely even wear these a lot and they're comfortable i know they may not look comfy because the heel is pretty high but i find strappy heels like this not too bad to walk in personally so i love those and then the kind of random i basically i'll tell you a little story i have a pair of gazelles i love they're like a pink blush color. I've showed them before in a haul, I'm sure a few months ago or something. They're really great. I think they're comfy. They're lightweight. I don't know about comfy. They're just like, they don't have like a lot of padding, but they're cute. You know, I love gazelles. People love them or hate them. I know it's in between. I want them in like every shade. Like I still want them in like a cream color, a black color, but until I feel super inclined to order, I probably won't. I do want the cream ones, but I want a pair of red ones. I don't know what it is. I've been loving red shoes. I see red shoes. I'm like, damn, it's just like so fun. It draws your attention. Your outfit can be so boring. You could literally wear black jeans, a black t-shirt, and then like black v-neck t-shirt, and then red heels, and it's like revolutionary, you know? So I saw they had red gazelles. They were, they didn't have them on the Adidas website anymore. I think they were like, a, they were like a limited color or something like that. So I found them on Macy's. They only had them in a seven, which is my size. So I ordered them. I forgot that they're like super, um, they're like a size they run a size too big. I look at my other gazelles and I have been a size 6 and I'm a normally a size 7 consistently. I've never not been a 7. And so they're a little big on me. Um, I'm still going to make them work, I think. They like, I feel like, I don't know if I'm just like crazy, but I feel like they make my foot, they make my foot look really big because they are like, I don't know. They're, okay, oh, I forgot to mention, they're also like a men's 7, but I don't know if that made the difference because like I compared that, like they're just a size bigger than a 7, so they're like an 8, so like how does men's sizing run? Is men's sizing one or two sizes up? Because I don't know. Because these are definitely a, just a size too big on me. Because I compared them, I put my other result against it, and it literally it's like it's like this much. So if I put like cotton, I think we did put cotton, like the thingies in the front of the shoe. I know I could return them and like go find a different website and go like, but like, do you see the struggle? Like, yes, I could ship them back or drive in LA traffic for two hours, take them to the store, and then order from like I think they have them on like Foot Locker. Order them on a different website and then wait for them to come in. I know, like, I could do the hassle. Or I could put a little, a little cotton swab in there, you know? Just cotton fluff. So, let me know other ways, like, what you got. Like, let me know about the men's sizing if you know. Let me know what your thoughts are. Would you just keep wearing them? They look fine. Like, I've tried them on. I don't feel like they make my legs look too big. It's just, like, me because I'm paranoid because I know they're big. So, you're, like, staring at them. But they're so cute. I'll link them down below. If you're a size 8 girl, pick these up because they will fit you perfectly in the size 7. Like, they're so iconic. Like if you're a size 8, this is my PSA to you. Go get you these. They're so freaking cute. I love them. For the fall, perfect slip on shoe. So I got those. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I love filming it for you guys. Let me know what you think about this new new temporary. I can film here more. It's comfy. I like this chair, girl. So I can film here more often or if you prefer the original. 
location better. And I will talk to you guys so soon. Feel free to subscribe if you want to see my next video. Or if you want to check out my vlog channel, feel free. And I'll have all my socials at the end of the video. So find me there. Bye. Girl, you know that I'm right behind you.